Hi, I'm Lucy. I'm a high school student and I'm from New England. I've been someone who's loved to make and create my whole life. I grew up with my grandmother teaching me how to sew and knit. My dad would be in you know, the wood shop with me. Um, but I actually never took an organized art class until my junior year of high school. So I sort of walked into my college counselor's office when I was starting to apply to schools. And I was like, I want to go to architecture school and design school. And she was like, all right, well, better get started on a portfolio. And I was kind of like, ah. So <laughs> I walked in and signed up for an art class. And I actually initially got put in ceramics instead of studio art. And I was really mad because I didn't want to do ceramics at all. So I went into my first day of this class just completely negative, didn't want to be there. So upset that I wasn't signed up for studio art. They brought out the bags of clay and they gave me a ball of terracotta. And our first assignment, which was to create two figures, two contrasting figures on a certain topic. So I immediately just got so inspired and I made these little three inch tall figures based off of healthy and unhealthy relationships and just immediately got really, really invested in this project. And I don't remember a free period after that where I wasn't in the studio <laughs> working on something, uh, whether it was that project or the ones that came after. And I've just never gone back, you know, ceramics and clay and glaze, they've just all been my main media since then. And I absolutely love it. My current focus in my artwork is in personalities through body language. A lot of my pieces are focused on real people. I love meeting people and learning about their personalities and seeing how I can communicate them through body language and through a piece that sort of expresses their personality through body language. Next year I'm headed to architecture school and I'm really, really excited and what I really want to do is bring my sculptural skills into the buildings that I design because I feel like architecture is such a beautiful mix of art and of functionality, of structure. So I really want to combine art and structure in a way that's really seamless and beautiful.